Good morning. Praise the Lord. This morning, uh, January 20th, we'll uh, remind ourselves about, about hell also. Hell is also real, so we should know about it. Yesterday we spoke about uh, heaven. Today we'll think about hell. Uh, in Matthew 10:28, uh, Jesus himself says, Do not fear those who kill the body but cannot kill the soul. That means the human beings. But rather, fear him who is able to destroy both soul and body in hell. That is Satan. So Jesus is asking us to be afraid of Satan because he is a killer. He will take us to hell. Uh, in the New Testament, 162 passages speak about unrepentant people going to hell and 70 of those were described by Jesus as he warned people to avoid it. When the unsaved die, they go immediately to hell. Later at the end of Christ's uh, thousand year reign on earth, the unsaved will leave hell, receive their resurrected bodies, go to the great white throne judgment and will then be cast into lake of fire. That, uh, that is uh, given in Re Revelation 20 uh, chapter 11 to 15. They'll, go, they'll be there forever. The Bible teaches us that there are two compartments to the uh, underworld. Hades or Gehenna or Sheol and, and that is the lake of fire or hell. Hell is the place of eternal conscious punishment for the devil and those who die without receiving Christ. It is characterized by despair and anguish and an awareness of the total absence of God. It's stated in Psalm 88, 3 to 5. No one is banished to hell until the time of final judgment. Jesus spoke about hell more times than heaven because he wanted all of us to be aware of the truths about hell and avoid going into it. We should remember that Jesus Christ himself came onto this world so that he can take us back to heaven to be with his father rather than go to hell and be with Satan. Hell is a place of unquenchable fire. There is thirst, weeping, wailing, gnashing of teeth, hopelessness for all eternity. It's a place of originally prepared for the devil and his angels. All these uh, statements that I've made are from the Bible. Matthew 3, 12, Matthew, Matthew 8, 12, Luke 16, 26, Matthew 25, 41. They are all given by Jesus himself. Hell will give us a better testimony as Christians. If we sin, we go to hell. The knowledge about hell will stop us backsliding from our faith in Christ. Jesus is asking us, for what shall it profit a man if he gains the whole world and loses his own soul? So we should be careful that we won't go to hell. Let's pray. Lord, Heavenly Father, please help us not to go to hell. In Jesus' precious name I ask. Amen. God bless you.